so you want to find profitable niche markets great so you've come to the right place congratulations if you haven't yet watched video one however I'm gonna urge you to go back and check that out okay because that's really gonna lay the foundation for what this video is about because you're probably thinking like you'll probably come into this video and understand what it is that I'm teaching you but you won't really grasp the the, the real concepts and you won't gain the true knowledge that can actually be gained from this okay because this is this is really good stuff all right not me need to my own horn just letting you know so here's the thing all you need to do is go to the channel or check out the the description of this video and I'll have a link in there for part one watch that first right it'll really kind of give you the right foundation like I said because this video is really all just about confirming the niche that you have found is in fact profitable okay so the very first place that we are going to go to find a profitable niche market is Amazon all right so if you have not heard of Amazon then you're probably living under a rock in Saudi Arabia all right but basically Amazon is the biggest online retailer there is in the world like these guys are literally like crushing offline stores and closing them down because they are big they are getting so big and so authoritative okay so they their number of probably one two three four five six seven eight nine ten online but in terms of the offline business as well they are really like killing those businesses all right now I don't I don't mean that in a bad way of course it's sad that you know people lost a job and so on and so forth but welcome to the digital age of 2018 okay and it's only going to get bigger online so what you can do to confirm whether a niche market is in fact profitable is come to one of these websites okay Amazon is the first one that I'm going to talk about I'm actually going to go into uh, three different websites all right so Amazon being the first one and all you need to do is come to the departments now you're thinking hang on what what does that mean so you just scroll over here okay so you type in amazon.com in the in the URL you'll come to amazon.com then you go to departments these here are your markets but once you hover over one and you go into it then you've got your niches so look books and audible okay so books books children books a books.com magazines textbooks textbook rentals sell us your books prime student each one of these is a niche market and here's the thing guys Amazon is generating generating um, hundreds of millions of dollars I wouldn't be surprised if it was in the billions okay I haven't looked up the numbers recently but here's the thing if this every single one of these like this picture is here for a reason this picture is here for a reason this card is here for a reason they use these colors for a reason they use these as the top um, they use these as the the top browsing features for a reason okay so this here alone has got my browsing history because they know the more you see an item the more likely you are to buy it so these are different uh, these are different things that I've gone through that I can that um, if I see again then there's a better chance that I'll actually buy it all right so if you go into departments and you realize every single one of these categories is here for a ridiculously profitable reason all right but again these are markets and that's not why you want to go into them um, if you if you're wondering as to why that is is because you didn't watch video one go back and watch video now one and then come back and let's continue on with this uh, with this second part here okay but look before I go any further let me just tell you if you want to learn how to make 10k within 90 days or less per month online okay then my my uh, mentor and I have put together a very special training for all of my subscribers and all of my followers that is exclusive to us okay so look if you want to check that out there is a link in the description and there is a link as the very first pinned comment on this particular video where you'll find a hundred percent free access to that four-part video series all right I, I urge you to check that out that's really going to change your entire outlook on this game and how to go about doing it like a professional okay I wish I'd found this video when I started doing affiliate marketing 10 years ago I tell you what I'd be a multi-millionaire right now but here's the thing at least you're here now and you're able to check it out so go ahead and click on it check it out and then come back and watch the rest of this video series all right so here's the thing every single one of these categories is a market and you don't want to go after markets instead you want to hover inwards and check out every single one of these niches okay these are niches that are actually worth going after so let's just look at an example for um, beauty and health all right so beauty and grooming men's grooming there you go so beauty and health is the market men's grooming is the niche so if there is in fact a niche that is listed on Amazon I guarantee you it is making a shitload of money all right so if you, you can go here 
here and you could go micro niche levels okay so this is men's grooming and these are the micro niches okay so you've got shave which is manual shavers electric this is micro micro niche right here um, you've got a uh, skin care you've got body care you've got hair care oral care kits and gift sets so every single one of these is a niche market and that's how you confirm so once you once you go through video number one and you identify what it is that you actually want to do or the three or five things that you want to check out then you come here to Amazon you have a look at the departments and then you have a, you, you scroll through these and see if you can find something similar say for example you want to get into sports right sports and outdoors that's a that's a pretty popular one and we want to get in we want to be promoting like uh, uh, sports collectibles now let's click on this and see what it actually brings up and then so if if you're if you're getting into sports collectibles bang you already know straight away that you're in a niche okay but you'll probably want to niche it further but you could actually just do that as a niche because I, I doubt very much on YouTube that there would be a lot of people doing talking about sports collectibles let's just dive into this real quick and see what comes up just just to make it interesting so look at this collect on uh, semicolon sports memorabilia on eBay 653,000 views um, selling sports collectibles uh, uncle insane collection of vintage sports memorabilia bill sports collectibles so this guy probably does something like this okay bill sports collectibles it sounds like a niche so if we just have a, a quick look here so look unfortunately bill has done absolutely fuck all with his channel um so he's only got 728 views in eight months so that's promising on, on a one minute and 29 second video right um he's he's got uh 728 views but i assure you people haven't done anything because they came and he hasn't done anything himself so why the hell would they bother so what you could do is is you could go into the sports collectible niche right and you could create a video on all of these popular items every time um amazon releases a popular item you could do a video on on this right here so nba and michael jordan so uh this is probably uh, this is the new england uh patriots this here is the new york yankees right so you find the let an item that they're that they're um that they're popular in uh that they're that they're selling right and then you create a video and adding your own opinion your own spin and your own twist and your own editing and you release that video on your channel now all of a sudden you're an authority in sports collectibles bingo you have now just carved out a niche now it might not sound like a whole hell of a lot but look this is $25.55 let's just bring it up right so $25.55 and, and that's a, a four pack say for example some someone decides that they're gonna buy um, let's just have a quick browse here uh, they decide um, yep yeah, you know what at the same time I haven't bought any basketball um, cards in a while so I'm gonna buy this set right here um, one autograph or memorabilia for yep $22.95 $22.95 then they go you know what um, oh, oops tw 25.55 plus 22 dollars 95 um, this sounds really interesting 14 uh, 25 of unopened 300 unopened baseball card collection um, so that's uh, plus 14 dollars 25 and they go yeah I'm done for today and they've spent 62 dollars let's just say for example in this niche that you make uh, eight percent okay so you've just made five bucks from from your video that you've released on YouTube um, creating you know anything to do with uh, what's this uh, Panini score NFL football trading cards okay now look I'm not saying you know you know go after things that are gonna get you paid five dollars at a time what I'm trying to say is that you can now use Amazon and the millions and millions and millions of dollars that they have spent on researching um, to find the most profitable markets that you see right here and then to find the most profitable niches that they dedicate entire pages to and the sub niches that are actually already done for you as well all right so look Amazon has done all the hard work they're the ones they're the pioneers okay they're, they're the ones who have gone in and they've they have spent the millions of dollars to figure out if we put this text here how much more money does you know one out of uh, uh, how much more money do we make out of you know 10,000 people that visit this page and then they'll find that that's more profitable than the last one and then that will become the landing page okay this right here a landing page and then they'll test it again and again and again until they find what is most profitable to help help themselves because if they don't help themselves make money then there is no way that they're going to stay in business right it just makes sense if you think about it hopefully you're starting to connect all the dots here so the second website that we are going to go to to confirm a niche because 
just because it's not here on Amazon doesn't mean it isn't a niche that's worth going after. All right. The second website that we want to go to is eBay. eBay is another big website and we're going to use it exactly the same way. Um, but there are, uh, there is something else that I want you to check out. So here's what I like about eBay that Amazon doesn't necessarily have because they've laid out their website in a specific manner to get, to encourage people to buy more money. And yes, in case you didn't know, eBay does actually have an affiliate site that you can sign up for and promote products just like Amazon. Okay, so here's the thing. If we come into eBay and we want to check out all of these here are all their different markets. Okay, these are all their profitable, profitable markets that they've decided to put up here. Here's what I love. Say, for example, you decide that you're going to get into electronics. Bingo, right here is the top categories. What this means is that this is the top one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, the top seven categories in the electronics department, okay? And when they say additional categories, they're just saying that it's it's other stuff that people are quite interested in, but it's not as popular as these ones. So say, for example, you decide that you're going to get into electronics, you realize, holy shit, it's actually a market, it's way too big to go after, I am going to dive into a niche. And what, I really, what I'm really interested in is actually cameras, right? Oh, well, let's not do cameras, okay? Because there's a lot of that sort of stuff on YouTube. I want to dive into video games and consoles or let's camera drones, okay? Let's go into camera drones because that I don't see a lot of that um, on YouTube, although I'm sure there are people doing it there that are making money, but we will full circle back to that in the end, okay? So, you're thinking, wow, look, look at all of these drones. Like, holy crap, you probably didn't realize how many drones there were. I sure as hell didn't. So this is new for me too. I'm literally taking you through a process that I would follow if I was to do niche, if I was looking for a niche affiliate market to get into. Okay. So look, this is the, this is the, uh, sorry, electronics being the market, um, camera drones being the niche. Okay. And all of these here, these are all the micro niches that you could dive into that would make it even easier for you to rank. Now, here's the thing, just like Amazon, if, um, if, eBay has made it a big enough point back here to make it a market. It is huge money. Okay. If they make it, if they, if it's a top category, it's making a lot of money as well. And so you could probably dive into one of these seven and you would be good to go. Like you would be making a, a crap ton of money, uh, being, find, finding ways to promote different things. Like there you go, camera drones. And then, um, you could go into what else? What's camcorders? Uh, so that's just a different thing altogether. Okay, I get it now. I get it now. These these are all of their different niches that they've got right here. Okay, so you can you can for example you can go in and create a video about DJI, uh, Parrot, 3D Robotics, GoPro, um, Hubson. See all of these all of these here are the top brands that they've put out because they know that's most likely what's going to make their money. The limited time deals are probably the auctions they're running, and I don't want it, would necessarily want to promote auctions. Reason being is that like your 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 commission is based upon a product being sold so if you can figure out a way to promote auctions based on the um the type of drone that you're promoting as per search through ebay okay sorry you might need to rewind that and watch it like three or four times because it's a mouthful but if you can figure out a way to do that then i would do that but i would be more inclined to promote the brands the ones that are on here literally selling their products for fixed prices that you can latch onto and start making money from excuse me <clears throat> The third and final website that I would go to to confirm whether or not this is a niche because here's the thing, Amazon and eBay are both um, more physical based products. We want to look at something that is digital, okay? And in fact, I'm going to dive into one more after this, uh, but let's just go into this one first. ClickBank, I would click on the affiliate marketplace and then it brings up all the different categories. So again, the same thing, the categories are your markets and then you can dive into niches, okay? So let's just go into fiction. Uh, let's go into green products okay we haven't we haven't touched upon that yet so these are probably actual f uh, physical products i'm guessing um new new home solar energy system off the chart conversion rates yep a uh, new battery reconditioning course battery reconditioning course holy shit can you believe that there are people on here actually making money from this and here's the thing like the uh, the the average sale is 47 dollars 53 cents you know wouldn't you like to create a video that gives you 100 sales now you know all of a sudden you've made five grand um and the gravity look at this the gravity is at 148 
which means that there are 148 people that have referred to this product and made money within the past one month. That's pretty fucking insane if you think about it. Like, I didn't even know there was battery reconditioning courses, let alone 148 people who are referring it and making sales from it. That doesn't mean that there's 148 sales. There'd be a lot more than that. It just means that there's 148 people that are making sales, okay? Those, those 148 people could be averaging five, right? And then you pull out your calculator and you go, 148 times five, 740 sales in the last month. So there's a market here, right? So if you divide this by 30, there's 24, almost 25 sales per day happening for this particular product. Now, if that is not a micro niche, micro micro niche, I don't know what the hell is. New battery reconditioning course. I mean, who the hell even knew this stuff existed? Um, if you're one of those people, I mean, no offense. Okay. So here's the thing. Let's uh, let's let's dive into something else: health and fitness. Because I came here to talk more about uh, digital products, right? Like that, like that course. So uh, lean belly breakthrough. The truth about ketogenic diet, Organifi is a physical product, um, Yoga Burn um, is probably like an online course, Attention Media Buyers contract for a product for the mass market of both yoga and weight loss, so uh, that targets women of 35 plus, so it gives you the information right there, okay, um, so if anything pops up under here, right, the categories, these are your markets, okay, so if, if you're just thinking, oh, I want to get into computers, too big, if I want to get into betting systems, too big, um, but what you want to do is you want to click on it and go into the actual um, uh, niches themselves. So here's here's three different like here's three different niches that it brings up just there, and the health and fitness. Here you go, bingo. All of these right here. These are all niches and money making niches at that. I guarantee it. Okay, ClickBank has been around since the donkey's ages. I'm not sure when that was, but they've been around since then apparently. So here's the thing: uh, addiction, beauty, dental health, uh, dietary supplements, diets and weight loss. These every single one of these are big money making niches, or they wouldn't be here. Okay. Same thing with Amazon. These guys want to optimize. They don't want. They don't want you to click on health and fitness and go, holy shit, there's 50 different things. I don't know where to start. They put it down to the ones that can actually make money. Right. Right? So it makes sense, right? If you think about it, health and fitness is a market. It is a big market and it is way, way too big to get into straight up. But if you look into men's health, mental health or nutrition or even remedies, these are all different things that you can dive into. Okay, so I'm just clicking on remedies just to break it down one step uh, further. The big diabetes lie. There you go. There's a course right there with a 90% commission of $36.56, right? There is a gravity of 96.9, which means what exactly? All right, so I paused for effect there because I was hoping you would say seven. Nine, uh, that means that there's 97 people in the past month that have made sales, right? With an average sale of $36.56. So this is a one-time sale product. Now, if you're doing, uh, if you're looking for profitable niche markets, this is exactly what I would do to try and figure out how to actually get into it, okay? Now, one more that I wanted to touch upon is JVZoo because they also do um, digital products. I should have thought about this one at the beginning. I mentioned that we'd be talking about four different websites to not three, but look, it doesn't freaking matter, right? So these guys are not as old as ClickBank. They have probably been around for, I think, six or seven years now. Um, I've promoted products from JVZoo. Um, it's relatively easy and you can make money, okay? I just, I prefer ClickBank and I found a lot of the bigger guys go into ClickBank. And, but this has a lot of different, um, especially online marketing stuff that, that you could promote if you're in fact in that space, okay? So like, for example, like Site Contact Elite One Time, WordPress Quick Launch 2.0, FB, Com Azon Multi. I mean, the names are terrible. Don't get me wrong, but you know the the products sell, and they they look they're this week's top sellers. So you know for a fact that these are already selling. They're already making money. Okay. So what you what you want to do is is you create an account, you log in, and you look you look at the different categories. Okay. Here's here's all your different categories that that they actually cover, and then you decide that hmm, I actually want to get into software, and I want to be promoting that. So you go into you click into the into that particular category and it brings everything that's available okay it brings all the products that are available that you can promote as an affiliate so if you want to but if you want to look at all the different niches all you do is you scroll down on the left hand side you scroll down to your particular market that you clicked on and here are all your different niches website design systems creation systems admin hosting hardware right so you just click on one of those and it brings up all of the other products that are available for sale now I'm not surprised because I told you JVZoo was a, um, a digital product based 
uh, company just like Clickbank once upon a time was but no longer is okay I'm sure what JVZoo here is the reason why they've got this as a category or as a niche is because they are going to be diving into it sooner rather than later that's why it's actually available as an option but if we look at software and we look at hardware there's yes there's nothing just yet yet but here's the thing if you want to get into databases if you wanted to get into software programming, website design, um, hosting, these are all different niches that are available and you know for a fact are profitable because these giants that are pumping millions of dollars of sales have made enough real estate for it. There is a reason behind it. It is not a mistake. Okay, so here's another one, self-improvement. Um, you might want to get into self-improvement, but you're thinking, oh, what do I do? Do I just get on and share tips and tricks and all that sort of stuff? No, you dive into a niche and you figure out what it is that you want to actually try and dominate and you talk about about topics around that <clears throat> time management stress management um, self-defense public speaking and finances eating disorders right there are a ton of things that you can touch upon in order to find profitable niche markets so look go through video number one really dial in your three to five ideas of what you want to explore as to what market you want to get into and then come to those four particular websites okay and you dive into them and that's and then once you figure out yep this this is in fact actually a a, a niche not a market and I want to confirm it on on um, on uh, on YouTube. Then what you do is you come in here and you go like this. What was one that we were going to get into? It was like uh, uh, sorry, sports collectibles is actually one that we were already going to get into. So if we just go sports and we can't see that collectibles is one of the top 10 okay so that kind of sucks but you know what that doesn't surprise me at all because a lot of people come on YouTube to watch sports highlights so we want to go sports um, collectibles collectibles okay so we the the keyword And we see here that there is that it is a fair. Why? Because there is a, there is a bit of competition. Okay, it's in the orange range, which means it's probably like seven out of ten difficult to rank for. But that's good if you can if you know how to apply everything that I've taught on this channel, then you'll be able to you'll be able to land land on page one um, with with relative ease. Okay, at only five hundred thirty two thousand results. Um, the overall ranking of 28 out of 100. Um, the search volume is pretty damn good. Like considering, um, <clears throat> considering there aren't a lot of people like really targeting this. Um, this is this is a hell of a keyword to go after. So if you're in sports collectible and you happen to be watching this. I would definitely go after this myself, okay? So anyways, look, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, go ahead and give me a thumbs up. And remember, if you want to learn how to rank videos, how to blow up your channel in the next six to nine months, how to create a six to 12, uh, a six to seven figure business within the next one year on YouTube, right? I want you to go ahead and click below, check out, um, uh, sorry, go ahead and comment below this video where you're gonna be given the opportunity to go into the end of month draw where you can get coaching and courses from yours truly. And I will show you exactly how to go about doing that in your niche, in your market. Take care. Much love. I hope you enjoyed this video. I sure as hell enjoyed making it for you. And I will see you in the next one.